Alright, you might have missed a start there where the logo appeared, and I apologize if that's the case. Uh, I forgot, I, I forgot to change the settings for starting a video on this one. Banjo-Tooie! Why am I blubbering about this? Hey there, everyone, this is Cow. Yeah, I played Banjo because we were like, what, a year and a half ago? Oh, it's so good. So, Banjo-Tooie, a game of my childhood. Alright, like, let's put some things together, though. Let's, let's be clear about something. Banjo-Kazooie is a game I had beaten like a dozen if not 20 times before the let's play i'm gonna press button now but the game's not gonna take it this is the one issue with the game i heard is that the attract mode goes too fast but everything else should be going all right so yeah so banjo kazooie i played it multiple times banjo tooie i also own that game and i think i beat it completely like in contrast two times not because the game is bad or anything but because beating this game is a much more involved affair it is a massive game that makes you go all over the place it's kind of more a metroidvania after you get to a certain point in the game with the way the game is set up and it's very involved it's probably something like donkey kong 64 size like being absolutely and completely honest uh, let's press the button it's Kazooie's face! Fantastic! And, uh, yeah, like, it's a fantastic time, but it is involved. So this LP is gonna take a while. A big matter change is, remember how in Banjo-Kazooie I could kind of go into a level and leave and it'd be beaten? We will not be doing this in this game. We will basically be doing two loops. One loop where I go through, get... Basically the moves and enough Jinjos to kind of get a feel for things, and then we are going... And then things are gonna shatter. Anyway, we got, look at kerning on these letters, just kind of scrambling all up over, over one another. That is funny. Is that? It's, it's something. Yeah, we remember you. Gur, 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 gur. He's trying his best, being a faithful little Igor, like. And it's been years since you've just been shuffling against that. Like, how does, how are you not dead? The, well, I'm guessing you're taking nap breaks and meal breaks. But I don't know, uh... You know, maybe... Maybe you also have a job still to get money to afford lodging and food. Anyways, the crew is all here! Mumbo plays well, and got all of Bonjo's money. I call him Bonjo, I don't know why. <laughs> That's just... It's kind of messed up. Mm hmm Wait, but you you are two against the others. Wow. I can't believe Kazooie cheats. But that wasn't even cheating, that was just stealing money. <laughs> That's probably worse. Alright. Must have been some shadows. Yeah, they kind of change uh, Mumbo's model, and now it's very much clearly his entire head, which is a weird, like, wooden colored skull. Like, my skull. I'm sure it looks like that. I mean, I wouldn't know. I will never see my own skull. So I can say whatever I want about it, and it will... I will never know. <laughs> Everything's so dark and dreary. And it's raining. These rocks look modeled differently, though. They're not just a texture, but it's probably meaningless. Oh my gosh, it's a drill! And, like, green smoke. A green haze. Apparently, the music uh, doesn't time correctly with a cutscene. This is true in the Xbox 360 remake and part of uh, Rare Replay also, from what I understand. Mumbo, not rock table. Yeah, I mean the whole yeah. Whoop! There he goes. He fell. Banjo's hanging on. I don't know if there's a if there's an earthquake. No, you shouldn't go outside and take a look. <laughs> that is a bad idea. By the way, this is yeah. This is a game on the N64. If you haven't understood. Mapping controls for N64 games that uses every button is an absolute nightmare. I've done my best, but we'll see how it goes. That is lopsided. 
like the, the, the driving part has got to be like super heavy to maintain like that, that massive drill. Oh man, no, it's even hollow. <laughs> this can still be super heavy. Man, that entrance though. It's a witch. It has a massive book. Build the arch. No, she's saying. Ee, 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 ee. <laughs> it's, she sounds like a creaky door. Whoa, oh no, she fell! She was in too big- oh, look at that cat! Angry Grunty will be! She talks like Yoda. Instead of rhyming. Everyone in the family it just kind of has a weird thing. Yeah, they're sisters. S sorry, spoilers, I guess. I'm not sure. Yeah, so, yeah, I know this game very well, but in the audience, please try not to speak about the future, right? Because some people will not know the game, probably. So let's try to keep the conversation up to what we know in the game, or that I might mention by accident, I guess. <laughs> Looks so mad. Well, you guys can't really play, because intrinsically you can just see Banjo's cars at all times. Because they're just kind of fused to that backpack. Because we will not leave, and we'll no never leave. I mean, she's still alive. The rock is still moving, which is impressive. Yeah, there we go. Loving family. It's just rock, though. You wouldn't think... Okay, I mean, I don't know how magic works. Oh, it's a bullet blaster! <laughs> oh, there's, it's actually written things on the book. I... Like, it was too late until I realized. I couldn't read it. I'll have time to post, but still. Check that out! Wow, that rock is not blasted. It is evaporated. <laughs> you have made matter stop being. Oh man, candy shot here. Oh! Would it take two years to skeletonize? I, I don't know. I'm pretty sure her clothing would deteriorate before her body. But still. Oh, I love Grunty as a villain though. She is just so charismatic. She just own every scene she's in. I don't know what it is about her, but she's just fantastic. Even as a skeleton. What? Your eyeball! How did your eyeball not deteriorate? I'm pretty sure that also goes pretty early. Animals just love eating eyeballs. Angel's hairy, but I'll what? Yeah! Well, hopefully, no. Yeah, look, there's something about his eye shape makes him look so angry. Bony man! Don't whack the bony man! I'll kick butt, then off to the castle! Yeah! Look at that, eager to just get the big old blast out bright and early. Here we go. Big ol' shots. Great aim. I remember this scene lagging so much on console, it's kinda gross. I don't know, I feel like the timing is pretty good of the music here. Like, it fits. Uh-oh. I said, uh oh, because of the cube, the music cue. <laughs> it's just him running back. Ah, Granny's back. It was a matter of time. Let's be real. Then just mine. I cannot miss. Let's see that furry fool dodge this. Yeah, here we go. Charge that spirit bomb. I bet she had two he No. That's why... Oh, right. Right, because Zooey started the whole scene. was like, whoa! You know, Grunty's here. And then she stole money. Why is everyone going out in turn when whenever trouble is afoot? Oh, no. Oh, that's... 
That's really unfortunate. Oh, my poor man. Bottles, the cat, the mole. Why the cat? I don't know, cats are good. There's a little kitty in the scene. You can barely see it, though. The hunch over. The tall life, I'm aware of that. So happy. And I mean, I get it. Whoa! Bats are out. Alright, just gonna salt the land a little bit here. Well, gotta be feeling this. It's not enough to just kinda get here and, you know, revive your sister. You also gotta spread your influence. Oh, Klongo! Poor guy. No respect for the man. You stay here. I'll be back. Have no fear. Why? Let him hit your right. I mean, maybe there's not a lot of room in there. That is a small little thing. Like, it is a small little building. Anyways, uh, so, in case you missed it, Banjo's house was kind of incinerated by a magic blast. That just happened. Everyone's scratching their heads. That hurts. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's all blackened and dusty. <laughs> the game is funny. <laughs> Look at that. See, he's a cartoon. He's completely fine. He's just all ashen. You still see his big bright eyeballs. It's all okay. All okay. I said it's all o oh. Oh. Hmm. All right then. <laughs> like this is nuts. This is how the game starts. They kill one of the major characters. <laughs> Kazooie just breaks the fourth wall immediately. I appreciate it. The game I feel is a lot more jokey than the first one was. I think. Like, they're a lot more overt with a fourth wall, and Banzo Kazooie was, was very already fourth wall none. Oh, uh, Banzo Sand. Uh, yeah, he's all down. Sigh. Oh no, it's gonna be a long and tough journey, my friend the bear, Banjo and Kazooie. And here we are. Spiral Mountain. I can do this. The health is different a little bit. Oh, if you attack, you just rat the tat immediately. You don't even bother with uh, punching. Yeah, how are you gonna help me? So that button did that. I can do this if I so desire. Do it the other way. I can do that. So I have all... Okay, this is gonna be my... Got it. You can do that, you can do this. Still have that. Yeah, like if I talk to this mole here... Oh, well, first we got a scene change. So you get all the moves from the first game. I don't know if there's like a thing where it tells you what to do or something. Oh, that's where the game will progress. You got this man shaking his fist. He's going her, her, her. That's what he does. Got it. See, like, look, it's it's the Spiral Mountain music, but it's so sad. Uh, all right, if that's where progress is... Got no eggs. Yeah, if I wanna spin an egg, I, I think that's not happening. And I don't have electricity either. Is there something if you go back in the house? No, I'm gonna do that. Look, buddy, you're dead. Deal with it. <laughs> like, just find a one-up or something. What do you, you mean no one made a golden statue of you? Can you jump out the window? Da, 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 da. You go in here. Alright, I feel like my duck... I should change it hand from R to L, but otherwise this feels pretty good. I can do that if I want, and it didn't look good. Alright, I was inside a house. For some reason, I was expecting something to be there. I know nothing, though. You can see the bottom of uh, Banjo's paws. That's pretty fun. Whoa! Fish! 
was knocked off the barbecue and ended up under this rather weighty boulder. Sure, if you... That's... Yeah, that's the ground pound. Uh, oh, you can't, like, beak barge this? How about if we do a little bit of... You can't, you can't do that from a handspring jump, though. Get out of here. Oh. Okay, then. This is it. That's what we're doing. Well, sorry, buddy. I I, I I tried everything I could to free you. Not possible right now. There we go. You're dead. Is that gonna talk to me? No, another man is gonna talk to me. Right. Here's a molehill. Yeah. Which ability? Oh, there you go. Uh, nothing, actually. I am not going to spend hours of my life learning all about the things I already know. It's fine. Play the game yourself if you want to know all these exciting strats. Why do I put a camera behind me? Maybe I can't here? I don't know. Alright, so there's... Uh, now they're all like in nests. Like that. Yeah, try using eggs. Right, now I can. I can do that. There you go. And now you shoot him in the face and he dies. Uh, fragile! Get out of here! Uh, is there anything to gain from that? Like, it's just all busted up. It's like, you know, everything's all but Yeah, that's accurate. You did it. You figured it out. Oh, cow. Uh, Alright, what else is around here? The frame rate is kind of super struggling. Except, like, I'm looking at the frame rate of... Symbol 64, and it is going at 69 or 59. I think it's just how the game runs. All right, you're dead. It happens. So if I talk to you, you're gonna tell me all about those exciting things that I know about. Great. Glad to be here. Why do I sound so aggressive after that? I don't know. Eh, eh, eh. So that cave is where we go to continue the game. And where I am explicitly sort of kind of avoiding to go. But yeah, no, uh, the game is infamous for running pretty badly on N64. Like, it would sometime fall into, like... Oh, whoa, there's a Kazooie door down there. That's new. Like, on console, the game will sometime fall to, like, 10 FPS in parts. It is just... The game is too much for the N64. And you know what? I respect... Rare for releasing that. Oh, that's probably a bad idea. But I respect them for releasing that. Can I not attach myself to that bridge and do something? Maybe you need to do it from over here. This is the Spiral Mountain. The spiral Mountain. Did I go there? In the... What am I pointing at? Something. I thought at some point it showed like a bunch of logs. Well, here's a bunch of flighty wings. It is currently quite full. I am rise. Okay. Oh, oh, oh! Do you you do give me the ability to fly? Whoosh! I'm assuming I can still do the everything. That is, there's a gem there. Gumbo! Gumbo! All right, and I went ahead and got myself hurt. Yeah, you can still go into Grunty's lair. Of course you can. Look at that. It's all messed Cheeto. It's all barred up. And all you also look sad. Everyone's just so sad. It's you. I know you. Yeah. Give us the cheats. <laughs> oh. I'm afraid Grunty ripped out. Oh. That's messed up. Because I helped you in the last. Yeah, okay. If you could look out for them on your travels. Well, cheats probably. <laughs> mm hmm. Let you in on a little secret. No, yeah, that makes sense. A secret of the magic book. And there's a. Let's press start and look at a menu. So, what does this look like? So, we got Spiral Mountain, and that's all we get. With the other worlds, okay, so, so your totals don't show up. Your totals of stuff does not show up until you get one of them. Got this all torn up, and there are... Oh, you can see it cycles between a different kind of feathers. That's smart. All right, now I can Wonder Wing. Wonder Wing. 
Yeah, I need to be very careful. I keep going on the wrong thing. It used to be, this was where the first Jiggy used to be. It is, well, yeah, like we picked up that Jiggy aeons ago. It will not be there anymore. You fool, but understandable. An understandable fool. Um, looks like there was like a ledge like over here. Oh yeah, that's a, there's one of those pages Cheeto was talking about, like immediately just finding it. Can I get it without landing? I don't think so. I don't even think I'm going to be able to get in there. <sighs> Alright, that's fine. Alright, let's practice using the shock pad. I practiced using the shock pad. And then the- Whoa! That load zone! That was worrisome! I thought a game froze! Well, it did. It just lasts for a few seconds. Does it give you a total? Like, it just, like, freezes there, and then it moves. Objects and items! That exists now. It's tell me I have one of those, okay. And if we go to view totals, does it tell me, like, one out of one? So it will tell me, right here. There's no- okay, so, yeah, that's well done, okay. Um, yeah, so we will be returning here. Like, this is part of the game. Let's go ahead and go in that cave, and I think that's where we're gonna end for today. This was clearly an introduction, but yeah, like, we will be returning here. There's a log zone. Is there anything to see there? There's a caged up part. I wonder if I can beak barge at. There's the shoes, so here's where you learn about shoes. The wadding shoes and the running shoes. I'm, so, I'm gonna be real. Like, oh, wrong, wrong button. Like I said, um, while I am going, I'm, uh, blah, blah, I'm gonna play assuming you don't know anything about, this is where Grunty was, it's still Grunty shape, that's fun. I'm, I'm going to assume you do not know anything about this game, but also I am going to assume that you do know everything about the first game, Panjo kazooie These are the assumption I made of the audience. Apologies if that is not you. There's a, clearly a little cave there. Let's check it out real quick. Can you go on top of the waterfall? I don't think there's anything on top of the waterfall. But here there's clearly a cave, and then there's clearly a flight pad to let you do more flying after you're done with whatever's here. So, alright, I think I'm not even gonna go in a cave at the end of this place. This is it, man. Alright, behind the waterfall! Here's a little nice little cave. It has water, it has clear water. It has this. Alright, I mean, there's a... What is that? Yeah, that's a Banjo-Kazooie cart. Just kind of chilling in there. I do not have the means to destroy this barrier. If destroying the barrier is what you do. I kind of don't remember, actually. So... Cool, great, awesome, great, cool. So like I said, we will be returning to this place. Like, you, you, Spiral Mountain does not get forgotten once the real game gets started. And this is somewhat of an adjustment you have to consider. The reason I want to keep going, it's... I clearly saw... Like, what looked like an entrance, but with like a gate on it. And I want to... See if I can... Wow, there's enemies, like, way up there. I mean, yeah, we saw them come out of the cage earlier. Alright, yeah, 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 right here. Gumbo! Oh, shoot. I did that wrong. I didn't die, though. No! No, okay. Like, there's clearly a, a hole there. But this thing that I am trying to do here is not enough. You cannot just smash a bird's face against a gate and expect it to open, weirdly enough. Well, that's just sad. Uh, and yeah, this was our intro to this game. I'm going to stop here. Which means it might take like two videos to get really started, this one and the next one. But like I said, the scale of this game is kind of absolutely ridiculous. So I'm gonna press this to change my camera angle. I'm gonna press this to... I'll... I can get used to that, hopefully. 
And uh, when you save and quit, it, it's not as dramatic as before. I, I'll show you even. Yeah, I'm sure. It just does that. <laughs> to be fair, we did not have like any um, cutscene about what they're up to back home. So maybe later it changes, but I'm pretty sure it's just that. It's just a fade out. It doesn't punish you for daring to not play everything in a single session. Uh, but, and you know, you get rewarded instead by the mirthful laughter of uh, Gruntilda the Witch. Uh, there's a button, eventually. It's start. You have to press start. Jump won't do. Look it out, it's a bird. Uh, so we played for 11 minutes. Shocking. Oh, yeah, a lot of today was cutting. All right, all right, it's the start of the game. It makes sense. I am so much forward looking to this, but also I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little afraid. Which I think is good. A little fear is always a little good. 